welcome to the very first homebody vlog. Homebodies. As of, as of Sunday, we have no choice. That's what I'm calling these. Rich and I are going to start vlogging. I don't know if it's going to be daily, but we just, I don't know. We just wanted to check in with y'all and thank you so much for watching our shows. And for those of you out there who are struggling or alone or just need some entertainment, we see you. Yeah, I'm very excited to be um, bringing this to you. This is going to be really quick today. And these are probably going to be quick because I don't want to spend a lot of all my life editing because that's what takes all the time. Mm -hmm. But what's new with you, sweetie? What's been going on since we recorded on Nothing. After Wednesday? Sun after Sunday, I can't leave the house without a mask. I know. So today is Friday the 20th. I think it's the 20th. And tell about what the governor is going to do starting Sunday. As of Sunday. Sunday evening, we are New York is in a complete stay home, like California. Mm -hmm. Only it's not as restrictive. Only essential services are open. Liquor stores are open. Oh, sh thank God. <laughs> First they close the bars. They can't take away liquor stores. So, I mean, you're going to start massive riots. So Rich and I, Rich went to the liquor store today just in case. But anyway, yeah, so... Yeah, so it's going to be and a you, little crazy. And you might be going day. They have elderly hours in the supermarkets around here now. Yes, we of went. Of course, there. No normal person would get up that early to go, but. If those of six, you what six to seven thirty at at Adams at, at Shoprite Shoprite. I mean, stop and shop. Stop and shop. Like, okay, so those of you who know our channel know that Rich and I are not early risers. We no. like to sleep in, so. Rich is not going to be going out. I don't want him going out because he's right in that risk factor age. So I'm going to go. I'm going to wear a mask and gloves. And There's I'm going to do to our get. shopping. It won't, they might not have anything. But I know. <laughs> I mean, oh, so what happened was I talked about on our show, we had Peapod. So I placed uh, a pretty big yeah. order with Peapod. And it came the other day right on time. And... A lot of things they didn't have, so they we didn't get we didn't get toilet paper. Whatever, it's fine. It'll we'll, we'll get it eventually. So, it's not so then today, so I went back on to um, yesterday and today to see if we could get another delivery. Nope, sold out. We can't get a delivery from nope. Peapod now. We were lucky to get the one that we did. Mm. So I'm gonna have to go to the store, which is fine. I'm gonna do the the early shopping um seniors over the age of 60 hi i fall into that <laughs> so so that that works out for us so that's what we're going to be doing mm. we ordered pet food from chewy.com Chewy and we got that today cat i shouldn't litter. be kissing you actually um mm -hmm. yeah and we got cat litter so we're set it's just like little things i mean i, I like sparkling water so i have you know I can't get Perrier right now, but... We have a German, first world a German deli very close to our house. And if you can call and order cold cuts, and you just go pick them up, and you're out the door. Yep. Yep. And, that, and they have roasted chicken and everything in there. That's know. very nice. I'm putting him down as an there, We went there yesterday to get cold cuts, and there was no one in there, which is very nice. So I'm wearing gloves, um, washing hands. If you order yarn from me... Just rest assured, I wash, I follow CDC guidelines, you know, for packing and everything, so we're good. Went to the Up store the other day, the UPS store, so I had to return something, and they were not, their doors were not open, but they had a window, and they were all wearing masks and gloves, which I was glad to see for packages, so, yeah, so that's how it is. It's going to be like that for a while. It's a little crazy. Mm-hmm. The kids are, our kids are fine. They are playing Animal Crossing. <laughs> they are addicted. And you know what? I'm fine with it. My kids are in their 20s. What else do they got to do? What else do they have to do? Well, our daughter works. She works from home. She works for a major uh, tech company, worldwide tech company. But they're all at home working. And so she's been working. And then on her downtimes when things run or whatever she's been playing animal crossing <laughs> and the two my son is so excited they're so cute with animal crossing so i'm glad that they had they were able to download that to play so that's pretty cool and i've been working i i love working from home it's amazing and i've been dyeing yarn and 
shipping packages and yeah I go to the post office there's a big box I don't have to get near any people and I just wear gloves and open the box and put the packages in and we're set so I don't have to go I, I print all my labels at home which is nice you know so mm. yeah all right so I've been I've been baking I baked cookies today want to see because I got my flour, which was really nice. <laughs> I didn't have any flour in the house, but pea pod came through, so baked cookies. I just, our son went to visit our daughter in her apartment, and I sent some cookies over to her. So, do you guys want to see my baking cabinet? Let me show you my my baking cabinet. So, I this is like the thing that I'm most excited about with organizing I I've been organized I organized my entire kitchen so things are so easy and streamlined I did this back in January and I've talked about it on my show but I want to show you my baking cabinet so up here is all my bags that I haven't opened you know this is kind of like my stock and I have flour sugar chocolate chips pancake mix and some confectionery sugar and then here i got the um oxo organizers which i completely love i got them at bed bath and beyond i want more but I, they're closed now so whatever um so these are all this flour sugar brown sugar chocolate chips and baking soda and uh, vanilla and toothpicks and then on this bottom shelf is my mixer which I got at Christmas. If you guys watch Vlogmas, I got that, which I like. I really like the mixer. My liquid measuring cup. And I usually make use this PB2 for smoothies and things. And then Hershey cocoa, and then Pam way in the back. But what I really love about this cabinet is the doors. So I took some command hooks, and I hung my measuring cups and, and labeled them. So they're kind of off there now because they're in the dish drain. But yeah, I just put the cups back up there. So here's my measuring spoons and the cup and the KitchenAid mixer um, attachments. And it's fantastic. So that's it for today. This is a really quick vlog. What I would like from you guys is to post some questions down below for Rich and I, random questions about anything you want to ask. doesn't have to be about what's going on. In fact, I'd prefer it. So if you are curious about anything with me knitting, anything within reason to ask, to ask us, that would be awesome. So post down below, and I'm going to also call for questions on Instagram. And future vlog, we'll do a Q&A. So I'm going to end it here. Have a great evening. <laughs> I hope to see you tomorrow and cheers.